We tend to just have a lot of ide our ideas come when we're rehearsing. We do a monthly gig in London and we try and make it as new as possible. In fact, try and make it all new every month for an hour. And as a result, you get a lot of ideas kind of bounce around and songs pop up and just ideas. We have psychos from balls! <laughs> you are Tim Burton, the most visionary director of the last 20 years! What about Guillermo del Toro? <laughs> Don't you dare talk like that! <laughs> no, I have worked too long and too hard to see you screw this up! Here he comes now. You know what you have to say. So we have a sort of a, a, a kind of sketch in the show where Meatloaf and uh, Radiohead sing a duet. I remember your kisses so sweet as you made love on my motorbike. I since the night you left me, I'm howling at the moon like a wolf in the deep dark night. All right, Meatloaf, off you come. Right. I've always thought that my Meatloaf impression. Was was quite good. Um, I may be. I, I may be the. I may be the other day. Right. It's all right. I wouldn't say it's amazing, but it, it's pretty good. I say I'm a star without bats. What is it, Chris Martin from Coldplay? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, come on, you know, there are children dying in Africa. <laughs> and Jules Holland needs serious medical attention. <laughs> Jewish, um, your Jewish singing yes, sketch. Yes, we do, we do, um, we do Jewish a bit, medley, of, yeah. bit of Jewish medley. That was fantastic. <laughs> Who came up with the Jewish. idea for that? Shlomo! I think I've got it! Two, three, four, someday we'll be drinking with the seldom seen kid. There's a lady who knows all that glitters is gold, and she's buying a stairway to heaven. Relax, don't do it when you want to go to it. Relax, don't do it when you want to. Because again, we came up with it in rehearsal, and there's always, when we come out, we're doing in the full gear, there's always like a slight pause where you think, are the audience going to come on board with it? Are they not? And generally, nine times out of ten, I think they always do. But one time out of ten, yeah, um, they find it quite genuinely, genuine kind of you know, anti-Semitic. Bravo! Can you handle this, Moshe? Can you handle this, Tommy? Can you handle this? Sir? I think they can handle this. Ga ga ra ga 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 ra ga 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 ra ga 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 ra ga ga. Life is a mystery. Everyone must stand alone. I hear you call. Distinctly multi, you know, poly religious in, in, in as many senses as possible, really. Um, well, I suppose there's, there's only one sense, really. Yeah. Bonkers. Probably from ideas that have been spawned either by individuals or, or indeed as, as a group, um, someone might will go away and probably write something in isolation actually and then bring it to the group and it might get rewritten by someone else or just get everyone's input and rewritten by that person again. It's and a then horribly it's bureaucratic process which goes on in the preceding month to a gig whereby there's various deadlines and everyone has to write and then there's a deadline for the first script and a deadline for the rewrite. We generate more paperwork than the UN. <laughs> Just looking bright, yeah. and this is the bit where you intercut yeah, yeah. it when we're killed in a car crash a few days later, and it takes on an added poignancy. Yeah. <laughs> the future is looking bright. Yes, I am, and I've got bread. Went through the rain and snow to 
buy some bread for toast, it's toast, we love the most that we are eating up the way. Should we wait? Yeah, let's wait. Bye! Bye. The other three, do you now know the truth about Tom, Nick, Jack, and Ben? And you know we are the three Englishmen, we are the three Englishmen, we are the three Englishmen!